This was really made at the end of the main video, but I'm gonna put this at the beginning because uh, I just thought not to talk about it, but I was like, why not? Because it's gonna be old news in the day. Uh, Jeffrey Simmons looks to get traded and the Eagles seem interested in him. I don't know too much about this story, but I know that I would love Jeffrey Simmons. Uh, just a great defensive player. He's rotational. He's just great. I think that he is up for contract at the end of this year, which is a little bit scary. I don't want to trade a high pick for someone who's only going to be here for a year uh, versus a guy who I could get for five years. Definitely aren't going to trade that 10th pick. Might have to trade 30. But, I mean, the Titans... Derrick Henry, Kevin Byer, Jeffrey Simmons. I mean, I don't know what's going on with them, but the Titans might as well be our minor league team. Like, because imagine if we steal just two of those guys. That would be insane. And we have, I want to say, $15 million in cap room. Now, $10 million ish of that, maybe a little bit more is going to go to signing our draft picks, but we don't have a fourth, fifth, and sixth round pick. So that's why I only have it at 10 million, even though most drafts would be like 12 or 13. But that is going to be it. Nope, because now you're going to see the main video. Uh, yeah. What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Taco Man. Today we're back with another video on the Red Taco Eagles channel. And there was some news that came in yesterday saying that Howie Roseman was likely going to trade the 10th overall pick. So where is he going to trade it to? And who is he going to select with that pick? But also, who has to be on the board for him to trade back? Because, say Jalen Carter's there. Say Tyree Wilson's there. You got to take him. Uh, so, yeah. Really, I think that... I think whenever you trade the 10th pick, it can't be too far back because I, I, I'm i in love with B. John Robinson, man. I need a running back here for the next five years that we don't have to worry about that's getting paid like $6 million a year. We need somebody like that, not somebody that, you know, not a defensive lineman that we can replace or an offensive lineman that we can replace. You're not going to get a running back like this for cheap in a while. And you look at the teams that are in front of us, I would say that uh, picks number one through five, Bichon won't go. But six, the Lions, they don't need a running back. Seven's the Raiders, they definitely don't need a running back. Eight is the Falcons, you can make a case. Nine is the Bears, that's probably our biggest. The Bears could get him. But they have bigger holes. So, uh, that's the Eagles. But also, you look at the teams behind us. The Titans, if they don't trade Derrick Henry, which if they're trading Derrick Henry, it's going to be to us. And then, who cares about B. John Robinson? Uh, yeah, and then 12 is Houston. Houston don't need to run him back. 13's New York. They don't need to run him back. They have Brees Hall. 14's New England, no, 15 is the Packers, no, 16 is the Commies, no. And we'll probably won't trade anywhere back more than 15. I would say 16, but probably don't want to make an interdivisional trade because they just normally don't work out for the other team. The Eagles always fleece on interdivisional trades. Uh, except for the one where we gave away Mike Parsons. But we weren't going to draft him anyways. And that's one of the reasons why I don't think that we're going to draft Jalen Carter is because Howie has never gotten a player with any character issues, ever. Even look back, he probably didn't draft Michael Parsons because of character issues. He... Yeah, he just doesn't like players with character issues. He likes nice, respectable guys. And I feel like Jalen Carter, you got to take this as sort of an issue. So there's that. And 
But still, I think that the Eagles could trade this 10th pick to round 13 to 14. I had them in my mock draft I did a few days ago, trading from the Jets, go from 10 to 13, uh, and then selecting Bijan there at 13. And that would just be great. And I know that Howie Roseman can do it. Howie Roseman's Howie Roseman. Like, he just knows how to do this stuff. Uh, but, yeah, I don't really have anything else to say so that's gonna be it for this video hope you guys enjoyed if you did make sure you drop a like and subscribe and i'll see y'all in the next one peace